So we got to talk about Trump's chronic venous insufficiency. Now, I know a lot of medical experts here have come on and explained what it is. Very common problem. I see it all the time, too. But I really want to give you a different perspective on this condition. Being that this is Trump and MAGA people, we're not going to trust the medical experts, right? Even though uh, his uh, press secretary mentioned all these doctors that ran these tests, we can't trust them, right? So let's talk about why we really think he has chronic venous insufficiency. So this is not from increased hydrostatic pressure in the venous system causing, you know, fluid to build up in the leg. This is increased pressure from the woke left causing too much stress on President Trump. If it wasn't for the media and the woke people in this country creating all this stress on our king, I mean, President Donald Trump, it would not be all this pressure causing all this leg swelling. Also, that darkening and that bruising of the skin that they keep talking about, that's not happening. That's a DEI thing. Darkening of the skin. No, we're not dealing stop listening to the medical experts who are telling you that chronic venous insufficiency is not a serious thing it's a very common problem don't listen to the experts this is very serious and i hope president trump is eating more beef tallow avoiding seed oils i think getting rid of some of those high fructose corn syrup from the coca colas he's drinking is going to help this problem as well of course we also can't forget that he got the COVID vaccines three four years ago who knows what role they played in getting the swelling